If you build client websites, you know the added pressure, tight deadlines, last minute changes, and don't get me started on why somehow you're still rebuilding the same hero or pricing layout again and again. That's why I have been testing different libraries for wireframes, for components, and I stumbled upon Kickstarter. And I think it's one of the cleanest versions I have seen of this type of libraries. So before you ask, they do release new layouts and and sections every single month. Everything is fully responsive and it is tested for tablet, for mobile, and you don't have to worry about that because we know how long that takes. And every layout, even on the free plan, comes with a commercial license. So you can use it on real client projects from day one. So probably you're wondering what is Kickstarter actually. Kickstarter is a growing library of modern and high quality components built specifically for Elementor, which is being expanded to Bricks and Figma, which is amazing. Amazing. Also in the future, Breakdance and Edge as well. And they offer all kinds of sections and components that we are familiar with. CTAs, testimonials, heroes. We know heroes are so difficult. Footers, nav bars, all the good things and very uncommon sections as well. So the whole idea is very simple here. Instead of reinventing a layout or starting from scratch, you just grab one of these clean components and build on it and customize it however you like. And it saves you so much time. So now let's get into it. Let's have a little demo. Let's see how this works. But I'm telling you, you have to try it. Okay, let's get into it. All right, before we get into the demo, I want to show you the pricing and some other details about Kickstarter. I will leave a link in the description below to uh, their website. Also, to mention, they were kind enough to give us 50% discount for whoever wants to purchase with my code. I will leave it in the description below and I will probably have it somewhere on the screen here or here. If you use this code, you get 50% discount on Kickstarter. But let's go to pricing and see how much it costs and what are the conditions, okay? So as you can see, we have a free plan. You can test it out to see if you like it. You get quite a few starter layouts to start with and it's amazing. Unlimited projects, you, you are getting so much here. It's crazy that they are giving this for free as well. These are the monthly prices. And if you go to annual, you get an additional 15% discount. Yeah, and these are the prices. They also have a lifetime deal yeah, which is this this one here. And as you can see, it's $399 forever. It's a limited time offer. I don't know how long this is going to last. I'm not going to speculate. But if you are not happy with uh, the pro plan or the lifetime deal, you can cancel anytime with a 14 day money back guaranteed. I love it when companies offer this because this means that they trust their products. I mean, you can use their product and then say, I don't like it and they will give you the money back. Amazing. This is what you're getting. There's a free plan, a pro plan and a lifetime deal. And now we can move forward with the actual products. Yeah. So you can see here that we have a drop down and you can access the library for your builder. Page templates, UI elements, Figma library, they will bring this soon. Kickstarter plugin, you can access all layouts in Elementor with their plugin. Let's go to the library first of all. And you will see here that you have the option to choose between navbars, footers, hero sections, headers, pricing, team, blog, career, gallery. Oh my God, uh, it's crazy. So we have also filter option where you can actually filter further. So let's say that we want feature sections. Okay. There are 287. You can already see how many you can choose from feature sections. Okay. So that's what is showing here already. You, we can filter further. Okay. We can filter by platform, which we are going to be using is going to be Elementor. And you can also see how many they have uh, for Bricks as well. If you're a Bricks user, this is also very good. And then you can filter down to layout, content alignment, columns, elements. You can also filter by interaction. Yeah, like hover, scroll, etc. Uncommon, which I love a lot. And also Bento. How amazing is that? And you can save the sections that you like into your account so you can simply click on this and uh, let's say i like this one and maybe this one 
and what else do I want? Uh, maybe this one. Yeah. And you can also preview them if you want. So let's just have a look. You can preview how it looks on different devices. How cool is this, guys? Honestly, this is amazing. And you can switch between your uh, preferred builder. And you can copy it straight away from here. You can copy it from here right away if you want. And you can just paste it in your builder. You can select between, again, you can select between the builder that you want to use it uh, in. And I'm going to go with Elementor. So we are going to do this. And I'm going to go right away in my... Uh, in my page here that I have prepared. And I'm just gonna go to the plus sign, yeah? And I'm gonna paste from another site and proceed to do the thing that you do to paste an element. And now it's going to add it on our page. And I think this is amazing, absolutely fantastic, it's so easy. But there's another easier way and I will show you in a bit. Let me just publish this. And let's go to the dashboard and I will show you what you need to install to have access to the components right away from your builder. You don't have to go to Kickstarter website and copy and paste and copy and paste. First of all, you have to add Kickstarter, the, the plugin, and Kickstarter Pro, the Pro plugin. It's like Elementor and Elementor Pro. It's exactly the same procedure, no difference, okay? And you will find this in your confirmation email uh, as well as in your dashboard. Of course, you have to activate everything, etc. And then once installed, Kickstarter will appear here on the navbar, on the left hand side of your dashboard and if you click on it it will ask you to insert your license this as well will be provided in the in one of the confirmation emails which will be sent separately from your license okay and you just add it here activate and it will show you like this that it your status is active. All right, so now since we have installed the plugin, it's going to make our life much easier. And I think this is the positive side of this component library that it's available right away in your builder. You don't have to change context basically, and you can use it much easier. So let's go to our pages and I'm gonna go to the page that I was editing earlier and let's see how plugin facilitates that. So as you can see, after you install it, you will have access to the plugin here. So it says Kit Starter Kit. So if I click on it, it's going to prompt me to what I've seen on their website. It's the library, right? So again, you can select whatever you want from here. So I'm going to go to another feature section and I'm going to go to filters. I'm going to go to uncommon because this is very cool. And you will see here, this is a timeline yeah, timeline, which is very nice, a timeline feature. So I'm, I can just simply insert it or I can save it for later. I'm going to save it here and save it here because I want this one as well. And maybe this one as well. And as you can see, these two have some CSS. They contain some CSS. So they let you know that you have access to some CSS here. All right. So I can simply insert it from here. I'm going to insert this one right away. And here we are. How cool is this? Of course, we need further something further down the page. So we have more scrolling space for this to fold perfectly. But let's just continue adding some other stuff. So I'm not going to add a footer right now. Maybe let's see a pricing. All right. Let's see what they have. Maybe they have something cool in the uncommon section and uh, nothing. OK, nothing. Either. But like, let's see interactions. OK, they have some cool ones. I am going to go uh, with Let's see what else they have. Okay, I'm gonna insert this one. I'm gonna insert a few to see, to get an idea of what they're offering, yeah? And then I'm gonna preview it on the front end. So let's go again to add, okay, not blog, logos, okay. Gallery, banner, Ooh, let's see event sections. That's very cool. I mean, this one's usually takes some time to, to create. Let's see, they have quite a few. Uh, anything special, uncommon, not in this case. A bento grid, not in this case. Interactions, okay, let's, let's use these ones. Oh, these ones are cool. You can see right away the dates of the events. I like that a lot. So I'm gonna insert that. 
And I'm going to insert a, a nav bar and a footer to see what we're working with here. So let's see what else I said. Yeah, I'm going to go for nav bar. But for nav bar, I have to go right away here. So I'm going to do this and go have a look at nav bars. And let's just see if they have something under uncommon. This is no, they don't have. This is very cool to me, this section. I hope they add more interesting stuff oh this one this one seems very cool and this these two are my favorite i think i can add it from here maybe this can be somehow moved somewhere else or i think it's going to be added okay it, it was added all right so now i'm gonna go and add a footer let's see footers 23 to choose from all right the most common wow i like this one yeah i think i'm gonna go with something like this this one's insert okay very nice i really like it i'm not sure if this is the heading that i wanted did i click on something wrong okay now we can preview let's see what we build i mean you've seen right how easy that was aha uh -huh, yes okay this is the right one all right cool 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 yeah of course everything needs to be customized but you have some something to build on and you it doesn't take you forever to do all this so let's just go and see how easy it's to customize i have some pictures here i'm gonna add some pictures i'm gonna add this one maybe i want to change the color of this background let's see what we have i am going to open the card all right let's see so not white i'm gonna go with green and then we will have to also change the color of the text but i'm just gonna go with uh green i mean you get the idea it's absolutely super easy if this is all you want to do but if you want to do something extra you can do that as well so you can change the style however you want obviously these are not the right uh, settings but uh, you know what i mean all right so let's see how this was built you can also open them and if you are new to element or even you can open up these uh, components in the structure here and look at how they were built to learn this is what I did when I had no clue on how to do certain things in Elementor and I was a newbie. I would take templates and I will look at them and learn how to build them. That was very helpful. So let's see. Let's change the color here to match our cards as well. I mean, you get the idea, right? And you might say, oh, the, it's going to take you so much time to customize. Yeah, of course it's going to take you time because that's the point. You want to make the website beautiful. You take away from the time with all these pre-built uh, components. You don't have to, you know, waste time on how to arrange and how to make this look good on different devices as well. So here we are. Okay. And of course you can customize further if you want. This is so cool. I like this. So these are the two workflows uh, that you can use to add components from Kickstarter, either with the plugin or from their website by copy pasting components. So I don't know. Let me know in the comments below if you want to see something extra where we can build a website with the components and customize it to look premium let me know in the comments below and i will do so but keep in mind guys you can get this for free try it out also as i said you're getting 50 percent discount on wh whichever plan you you want to get the paid plans obviously if you want uh, it's an amazing deal i would say go and get it if you'd like to see what else you can build with element or watch this playlist here or here and if you have gotten any value out of this video Please consider subscribing, liking, and sharing this video. And I'll see you next time. Bye.